I'm sorry. <clears throat> How may I serve you today, my queen? Conqueror of the seven realms, supreme sorceress of the order of magic and ruler over all people, including those who call you the conjurer of terror and the mistress of malevolence and mayhem, the dwarves who call you Magora the mighty mage, the witches who call you Gothmore the great, the fairies who call you the harbinger of harm, and the giants of the sky kingdom who likely call you by many names that no one knows because no one has ever met the giants. That's better. You know what they say, flattery will get you everywhere. <laughs> That's not what they... That is to say, how may I serve you, my queen? Tell me, Mirror, am I fair? You mean fair isn't just? Discerning right from wrong? No, you fool, I mean, am I fair? You know, like, beautiful fair. Am I fair to look upon? Why, yes, you are, my queen. You are indeed fair to look upon. But as it is said, beauty is only... Only what? I'd rather not finish that sentence. Finish it! Well, it is said by probably a bunch of nobodies that beauty is only skin deep. Mm. I see. Though you are a fool, Mir, you are a wise one. I appreciate your honesty. Honesty is a greater act of kindness than empty flattery. Yes. Tell me, Mirror, who is the fairest of them all? Honestly? Yes, honestly! Tell me now, or else I may smash you to bits! Uh, very well. It is Snow White. Snow White? Is that so? Yes, my queen. Tell me, Mirror, where is Snow White? I mean to have a little chat with her. Snow White is nowhere to be found, my queen. She fled the castle early this morning. Disappeared? Yes, my queen. I overheard, her speaking, I overheard her speaking with her friend the Huntsman. She said she could no longer stand staying in the castle with you and ran off into the woods. And she was alone? Yes, my queen. I must find her immediately! Where is the Huntsman? I will have him find her and kill her at once! I'm afraid that won't work, my queen. The Huntsman was her dear friend. She, he would surely betray you. Mm, I suppose you're right. Well then, you'll just have to show me where she is. I'm afraid I can't do that, my queen. As you know, my powers are limited. Then I shall increase your powers. One step. Where is it now? Aha! Here it is. Once 
I place this new enchantment upon you, Mir, you will let me be able to see into all the mirrors throughout the kingdom. Dar. That should do the trick. About that spell, I really wouldn't cast that if I were you. Oh, It'll allow mirror. all. Mirror! I'm enchanting. Mirror, mirror on the wall. <laughs> Gather reflections one and all. Reflect what is on mind and heart, and let all reflections pay their part. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! I feel like a million bucks. Uh, um, a million bucks. Yes. Now let's get to work, Mir. Show me all the mirrors throughout the seven realms. Somehow, some way, I must find Snow White. Thirty-two thousand five hundred eighty-two, thirty-two thousand five hundred eighty-three, thirty-two thousand five hundred eighty. Ow, stupid tangles! Thirty-two thousand five hundred eighty. Oh, four. No, I think I think it was five. Five. Thirty-two thousand five hundred eighty-four, thirty-two thousand five hundred eighty-six. 32,587, 32,580. I'm not buying up. One. I just can't seem to do anything without these darn coffee stains. I mean, you said I give up. What? Maybe I should give up coffee. These pearly lights just aren't what they used to be. Who am I? You know who I am, Mother. Stop playing your games. <laughs> I'm warning you, what kind of magic is this? What? No! D who are you? I asked you first. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. No, you... Oh, wait, that was you before. Before what? Before, before. You know, asking me who I was? Yes, that was me. Oh. So? So what? Who are you? Who are you? And what are you doing in my mirror? Why are you in my mirror? I asked you for, wait, I'm in your mirror. Yes, how'd you get here? I don't know, how'd you get in my mirror? I don't know. This is so weird. You're telling me. Are you spying on me? There are laws against spying on a prince, you know. I'm not spying on you. Are you spying on me? No, I was just polishing my teeth. Wait, you didn't see that, did you? I did. You, you did? Oh, 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 no, I didn't. I didn't. Uh, I wasn't looking. Uh, it, it was kind of funny. Funny? Oh no, no, don't cry. Uh, um, I meant it, it was charming. Oh, that was charming, was it? Watching me polish my teeth? This is charming to you? Yes, it is. It, it actually is. You can't imagine how charming it is. Well, well for someone like me. For, for someone like you? Well, what that, yes. what's that supposed to mean? Well, you see, uh, I've never really met anyone quite like you. Uh, I've never really met anyone at all, besides my mother. Uh, I've never seen a reflection in this mirror apart from my own or my mother's. What? Oh, no, mother says it's for the best and, oh, she'd kill me if she knew I was talking to you right now and, uh, are you real or just a dream? But I'm real. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm real. A and you're a prince? In the flesh? And you're out there? In the real world? I mean, yeah. What is this game you're playing? I love games. <laughs> it, it's not a game. I'm sorry. Uh, I'm so awkward. I, I've just never been in the real world before. What? Uh, it's, it's just, it's just that I'm feeling my mother. She's up. Oh no, mother's back. I have to go. No, I'm sorry. No, no. I wonder what that was all about.
Oh, what's the use? I can't seem to read a thing anymore. Stupid old Gaston just won't leave me alone. He keeps chasing me around, asking me to marry him. And then there's father. Oh, he should have been home by now. I'm so worried about him. Oh, great. Now Gaston suddenly appearing in my mirror. He just won't leave me alone. Oh, oh hey, beauty. Is that you? No. Oh, it is you. I was just thinking about how much I wanted to see you right now. I'm Want cursed. To flex? No. I said no. Oh, come on, beauty. You know you can't resist these muscles. Marry me and you'll have these guns to protect you. I don't need protection. I need companionship. Well, then I'm your man. Don't you know I'm the most popular guy in town? I have lots of companions. That is not... Ugh, why can't I ever escape you, Gaston? I just wish... That there was someone I could meet who was pure of heart and who wasn't as vain as you are. Ah, oh, it's no use. Look at me. I'm hideous. I'm trapped in this terrible curse. I took that man in anger and locked him away in selfish pride. Then what for? He's prisoner to me now, but why? What do I have to gain from this? Nothing. Nothing at all. Nothing but a sense of power and control. Uh, I control nothing! I'm trapped in this hideous curse! Uh, uh, should I let him go? He's no threat to me. He only sought shelter from the storm and to provide for his family and to give his daughter a simple gift. A rose. And yet something, something inside me, an, an instinct tells me I should imprison him. A rose? That's what I said, wasn't it? <sighs> you couldn't just give him a rose and send him home? No, no, that's, that's what my instinct. <laughs> that's what my instinct told me to do. Well, your instincts seem pretty foul, if I may say. And who are you to say? I don't know for sure, but I'm worried. You're worried? Yes. Well, I don't know how I'm seeing you in my mirror, or if this is even real at all or just a dream, but I'm certain you just described my father. He left home days ago on a journey to the shoreline for goods, and he should have been home by now, but he isn't, and... Well, I've been so worried all this time. That's so. Yes, it is so. And he promised to bring me home a beautiful rose. A rose, you say? Yes, nothing but a rose. And well, if what you're saying is true, then that would explain why he hasn't arrived home yet, you hideous foul beast. Ah, you don't know what you say. So it is my father. Come and find out. La, 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 la. Do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti. Ow, 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 ow.
prince is gonna dance with me all night long and we're gonna get married and be together forever and live happily ever after and we'll have little princes and princesses but mostly princesses we'll be together you and me and no one else uh yeah there we go gotta be picture perfect for the prince um, to those rats again. Or the birds. But we must get to the ball. It's almost time to go. Oh, we're going to be late. You always do this, girl. Oh, unbelievable. What do you think of these pearls? Oh, oh no. The, the time is it's time to go. Come oh. on, girls. Let's go get that prince. Coming, mother. I'm on my way. Oh, my well, Ow. I've got you in my spiny <laughs> All right. Time to get ready. Oh, oh, that is foul. Yeah, that's better. Just a minute, Glammy! Oh, yeah, this ought to do. All right. And here comes Glammy Dwarf, wearing his 1943 Germany-inspired outfit. Oh, ah, oh, wow. <laughs> oh. Oh no, darling. This just won't do. Whee! Oh yeah, this is bad. Real bad. Oh, are you hearing this mirror? Bunch of dwarves getting ready for work? Oh, we'll never find Snow White this way. Hello. Oh, it's me, Speedy Dwarf. Oh, man, I gotta be right on time for a special guest. Don't want to be late. Oh, I'm running out of time. Oh, goodness. Just a minute, uh, Sluggy. I'll be done in a second. Okay, all done. Let's go. And here comes Glammy wearing her, ooh, mink fur. Yeah, that's nice. Just a second, Sluggy. Don't worry. I know how slow you can be. I'll be in and out before you even get here. It's true, you're slower than a snail. Hmm. You know, does the, the red does work well, hmm. But I just don't know. <laughs> you know, we gotta dress to impress our new guest. All yours, Sluggy. Whee! Okay, time to get ready. The new girl has tidied up the cottage so well. May as well brush my beard. All yours, Bouncy. Are you, do you see this, Mia? These dwarves seem to be hosting a guest in the cottage. A, a girl. Hmm. I wonder. <laughs> Bouncy, don't worry. I'll be quick. I swear, I'll be quick. Oh, okay. Number one, love the sparkles. Let's give it a spin. Wee. Oh, that's nice. Um. Is the front too short? I don't know. Don't want to look like a gnome. 
you know, even though sparkles are nice, honey, this just won't do. All yours, bouncy. On. Okay. One, two, three, four. Let's go. All right. Step it into gear, everyone. Oh, just a minute, uh, Blingy. I've just got to finish my routine. Okay. Almost done. And finished. All yours, Blingy. Gonna go to the mines and work. Oh, nice. Look at Suave. Who are you? Me? I'm blingy. I lack shine at things and I cannot lie. No, I mean, who are you? Where do you live? I live in a cottage in the forest. Is and, this a dream? <laughs> and is anyone living with you? Oh yeah, I live with my board pals here. You like our crib? Oh, no, 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 not them. I mean, do you have a guest living in your cr crib? Crib. Oh yeah, oh. her. <laughs> She's legit. <laughs> what is her name again? Snow White. Why? Thank you, Bungie. Nah, it's Blingy, yo. Oh, whatever. Mirror. Man, this mirror is tripping today. Oh, mirror! Oh. Come on, come on. Really, mirror? No, oh, I... I'm, so I'm sorry, my queen, conqueror of the seven realms, supreme sorceress of the order of magic and ruler over all people, including those who call you the conjurer of terror and the mistress of malevolence and mayhem, the dwarves who call you Magora the mighty mage, the witches who call you Gothmora the great, the the fairies who call you the harbinger of harm, and the giants of the Sky Kingdom who likely call you by many names that no one knows because no one has ever met the giants. Oh, no, you fool! Weren't you listening? Snow White is dwelling with the seven dwarves! Oh, that's wonderful, my queen, conqueror of the seven realms, supreme oh, sorcerer. Shut of the up, of Mirror! We must act at once! What's the plan? I have a little something in mind. Yeah, as you would, your cleverness. In the meantime, I need you to find out where that mirror is. We must find the dwarf's cottage at once! Yes, my queen. Oh. oh, why must it all be so hard? Do the laundry, Cinderella. Wash the dishes, Cinderella. Where's breakfast, Cinderella? Why must it always be me, me, me? Oh, is this all I meant to be? Just an errand girl? Surely there's more to life than this drudgery. Oh, oh, look at me. I shouldn't be so woeful. At least... I have the mice and birds to talk to. I have a home. Oh, do I have a home? I just wish I could be off with my family tonight. All dressed up and dancing, dancing, dancing all night long. And you will be dancing. What? Wipe those ugly tears off your face, girl. They are much more unbecoming than any of the dirt was. Who are you? Why, I'm your fairy godmother, dearie. Oh? Yes, and seriously, wipe those tears away. There's no need for tears while I'm around. Look, I've sent you a clean handkerchief. No more tears, dearie. How are you here? You made a wish, and I'm here to see that it comes true. Through my bedroom mirror? Well, yes, it seems the evil queen, you know, the harbinger of harm, has cast an evil spell across all the seven realms. And now, all mirrors reflect what you most wish to see, whatever is on your heart and mind at any time. And for you, that is me. But I don't 
don't even know you. Doesn't matter, dear, you made a wish. And I'm here to send you off to the Royal Ball before it's too late. Oh, but look at me, I can't go to the Royal Ball. I am looking at you, dear, and I see a lovely young woman who any prince would be honored to dance with. Oh, thank you, but I've nothing to wear. Nothing a little matter can't fix. <laughs> oh, fairy godmother, they're beautiful. And one more thing. <laughs> oh, my. Oh, it's perfect. And you'll need a way to get to the ball. Hmm. Yes, I know just the thing. Oh, Butterscotch, is that you? Dear little mouse friend, yes, it seems he stumbled upon that old mirror in the barn doors. He'll make a perfect footman for your carriage. <laughs> Cheese, cheese, cheese. Where's that cheese? Gotta find the cheese. Oh, Butterscotch, you make an absolutely delightful human. Cinderella, is that you? Oh, yes, it's me. It's me, old friend. And I'm human? You are. And now you'll see that Cinderella gets to the Royal Ball immediately. Ah, yes. Butterscotch reporting for duty. I won't let you down, Cinderella. See that you don't. Wait, is there any um cheese involved in it for me? Very well. <laughs> Thank you. A carriage with six white horses awaits outside. Butterscotch will manage the coach. Now, hurry up and get ready, Cinderella, for the time takes away and magic only lasts until midnight tonight. Midnight? Yes, and you mustn't stay any moment longer. Understood? Oh, yes, fairy godmother. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Yes, thank you, thank you, thank you. Enough of that. It's time to go. Oh, oh man. Oh, man. Man, that was close. Oh, is the giant gone? Oh, good. Okay. I, I think he's gone away. Oh, man. I just wish I could be back with Mother right now. about that um you didn't climb that beanstalk did you well um well, i know you wouldn't listen no no look look mom look. see 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 what i found up here look it's a golden egg so i don't care what you found down there you will get your ticket home right now mom Mom, you've got to be quiet. I will not be quiet. You will listen to your mother. Mom, for mom, mom, you don't understand. There are like giants up here. Like, ah! Are you okay? I'm okay. It's it's a house plant. It's a begonia. But but there, there's giants, like big giants up here. You have no reason for you to come home right now. Okay, okay. I just got to do one more thing. Then I'll be home. Oh, Jack! Oh, that boy just for once I wish he'd listen! Oh, it is so scary out here. Is that the witch over there? No, no, it can't be. Just a squirrel. Oh, I need to remember my training. Wait, I don't remember my training. Oh, oh if only my father was here. He'd know what to do. Fajal! Fajal! Gretel, is that you? Yes. 
Oh, Fajr. Fajr, it's terrible. <gasps> we went into the woods and we had breadcrumbs, but then the birds ate them and we found this house with a delicious treat and there was a witch there. And then she had prison hostel and I had to work and feed him all day and I'm afraid she's going to... She's going to what? She's going to eat Hansel. Oh, okay. Oh, you get your brother out of there right now. You run away as fast as you can. <laughs> okay, okay, but he, I can't. He's locked in a cage. Oh, okay. Do you remember your training? No. Oh, okay. Well, you'll have to pick the lock. I'll teach you. Okay, first... Take a bone, shave off one of the sides, and stick it into the lock, and twist it until it tricks. Then get your brother Hansel and run out of there as fast as you can. <laughs> okay, yes, I remember it all now, but you will need to hurry. I will. Be safe and be careful, please. Yes, okay. Oh, hush, hush now, little one. Mother's here for you. At least for now. Oh, if only I could think of that rascal's name. I have only one try left. Whatever could it be? Nobody knows my name. Nobody knows my name. I spend strong to gold. I make promises of gold. But nobody knows my name. Rumpelstiltskin is my name. Rumpelstiltskin is my name. But nobody knows it. And nobody will ever know that Rumble Stiltskin is my name. Aha! Uh -huh. I've got you! What? I know what? your name! No, you don't! I do! It's Rumble Stiltskin! No, no, no! <laughs> Well, what do you think, Miro? You look lovely today, my queen. Oh, seriously? I'm sorry. My queen, conqueror of the seven realms, supreme sorceress of the order oh, of magic. No, 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 not that again. Well, then what is it? I don't want to look lovely. I want to look hideous. Rightio, then. Looking hideous today, my queen. Hmm. Missing. How about a wart? Oh, yes, yes, that's good. Uh, uh, ha, perfect. You look like a prune gone bad. And that's precisely what I was going for. <laughs> and now for the final part of my plan. The poison apple. Just one little bite of this and Snow White will be no more. <laughs> <sighs> Prince, Prince, are you there, Prince? Ugh, I'm so stupid I didn't ask his name and he didn't tell me. Prince, are you there? Or, or are you here? I don't know how this works. How am I supposed to do this? Okay. Um, how did, how did I, he's come in my mirror last time. Um, I don't know. Uh, Prince, Prince, are you there? Just a second, mother. Prince, Prince, it's me, Prince. I just gotta get this schmutz out of my teeth first, mama. Prince! Oh, no. hello there, hi. There's no time for that. You have to come and get me out of here at once. Out of where? Right. Long story short, my mother, at least, just, I thought she was my mother until we even had talked last time. She asked who I was talking to, so I came to you, went off the handle, told me so many things that I never knew. Like, she's not really my mother at all. She stole me from my mother and father as an, when I was an infant. After was, they stole some vegetables from her garden. What seemed really over the top, you know? And they stole vegetables from her garden, and she took me away and locked me in this tower my whole life, and you've never seen another person until you came along in my mirror. And if you're really real, I need, I need you to come and rescue me. Vegetables? I know, right? I hate vegetables. Mother always makes me eat mine. You're getting off point here. I need you to come and rescue me. Oh, yes, right, that part. Yes, I will come and rescue you. 
Awesome. Where is it that I'm going? Uh, I live in a tall tower with, with no doors. Okay, on my way. <laughs> Are there any other distinguishing features? Uh, uh, it's it's deep in the forest. Nothing but trees outside my window. On it! <laughs> Which, which forest? Um, uh, she, she might have mentioned something about a, a great forest, but she, but she never told me specifically. Okay, well that narrows it down a little. There's the great northern forest, the great eastern forest, the great western so forest, the great hunting hard. forests of Hamlin, the great eastern forest of Earl Boykins the So Thor. you're saying it could be any forest? No, 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 only the great forests. Are there any other clues for me? Um, we, we have some birds, a couple of rose bushes at the forest floor. What kind of birds? Uh, nothing special really, just some kipper white specktail and the occasional morning gale. You say specktails? Yes, we have a lot of those here. Then I know precisely where to find you. Really? Yes, specktails are native to the great hunting forests of Hamden. And get this, they're non-migratory. Hunters come from far and wide just to look at the birds. But, but not to kill them, I hope. No, no, no. Great hunters such as I, we travel far and wide just to look at birds. You love birds? I, I, I do love birds. <laughs> I love birds too. Well, that's great, because once I get you out of that tower, I can show you lots of birds. Birds you've never seen before. Ooh, I love that. Rapunzel, Rapunzel. Oh, oh no, Mother's back. Um, I have to go. Uh, my name is um, Rapunzel. Oh, oh no, I, I've heard it said multiple times. Uh, right. And, and your name is quickly. I'm Prince Edward Dashing the Third. Okay, okay. Uh, I have to go. Oh, oh, wait, one more thing. You're, yes? you're gonna have to climb my hair. Climb your. Well, I'm on my way! I... I forgot my keys. She was right here. I shouldn't have let her go. The spell could have been broken. I'm such a fool. That's right! You are a fool! The girl was right here! This spell could have been broken! Is that so? You think I'm just a fool? <laughs> no, no, sire. It was wise of you to let her go. You are very wise. Very wise indeed. Then why do I feel like such a fool? Because it was the most foolish thing you could have done. Unless it was the wisest thing he could have done. Oh, what do you know, you dumb clock? Uh, dumb clock? Dumb clock? Why, I ought to, I tell what. I ought to clock you. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I've got two hands and I'm ready to go. Well then, be my guest. Ah! Oh, 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 you son of a monkey! Oh, oh, you snuff your mother with that mouth! Oh, oh, yeah. Boys, boys, stop all that fighting now. 
You were right to let her go, sugar. You've done what is necessary for the spell to be broken. Now she must realize her love for you. That's what I'm afraid of. No one could ever love someone like me. Mirror, show me the beast. Beauty? Beauty, is that you? Oh, it's me, beast. Oh, it's so good to see you. I wish I was there too, but there's no time for that. You must prepare at once. Prepare for what? Gaston is coming with villagers to attack you. They mean to find you and kill you. Let them come for me. No, you must prepare at once. I deserve to die here, alone. No, you don't. Father and I are coming to help. You are? Of course. We can't let just leave you there to die. <laughs> Don't worry, beauty. I'll fight them. Beast? Beast, is that you? Come, father, we must go at once. Oh, man, I grow ever so weary of being a prince. All my mother and father want for me is to marry a princess. I've been matched with this princess and that princess and that princess and this princess. But none of them suit me, Mir. I know there's someone out there for me. I just wish I knew where. Is there a higher purpose to this age-old tradition? I just wish I knew. <laughs> What is this? Come in. Who's that girl? Wait. Wait, no, don't take that. No. No. Oh, no. Mia. No, what? Mia, where'd she go? Mia, tell me what has happened. What has happened, Mia? Hello, Prince Charming. <laughs> Who are you? I'm your mirror. My what? I'm your mirror, who, well, I'm everyone's mirror, really, but aside from one other, Prince Charming, you are the only one who has ever treated me like I matter, like a friend. Mirror, me, you're, you're real. I am, Prince Charming. I knew there was someone in there. <laughs> there is always someone in the mirror, Prince Charming. But, look, I must act fast. You see, my master, the evil queen... <clears throat> The evil queen, conqueror of the seven realms, supreme sorcerer of the order of magic and ruler over all people, including those who call him the... Mistress of evil and the mag... Yes, yes, you know of whom I speak, thank you. Yes. Uh, you see, she's looking to kill the princess known as Snow White. She was the one you saw giving a poisoned apple to the girl in the mirror. Really? Re really? That was the evil queen, the, the conjurer of terror? The very same. And that, that girl was a princess. Yes. Oh. Prince, Prince Charming, yes. I've come to you after so many years with you speaking to me that you must go and save Snow White. Of course, Mia. But why have you only come now? I wasn't able to. Long ago, 
the evil queen accused me of stealing. I pleaded my innocence, but she didn't believe me. You see, I was framed. She with cast a wicked spell upon me and trapped me in a mirror forever to be her servant. But now she's cast a new enchantment and I am almost free. All I need is for someone to overthrow her and I will be forever free. That is why I've come to you, Prince Charming. You and Snow White can overthrow the evil queen. Yes, of course, Mia. Show me where Snow White is. Okay, take me with you. Oh, okay, um. Mir, I don't know if you know this, but uh, how do I say? Um, you, you've always sort of been, I don't know, g glued to the wall. Come on, man, find your inner purpose. Oh, okay. <laughs> ah! Ah! Oh! 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 <laughs> Okay. Yeah. Good job, Prince Charming. Pick up your wig and off we go. You must <laughs> save Snow White. It's so dainty. No human alive could fit this shoe. I've tried it on every girl in the village. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Perhaps, perhaps it wasn't a human. Maybe a, maybe some sort of, of witch cast a spell on a small mammal, like, like a mouse or a bird or a newt and, and to turn them into a human and that's who I danced with at the ball. Yes, yes, that would make sense, wouldn't it? No, no, that wouldn't make sense, no. Or perhaps it could make sense. It very well could make sense. No, no, it couldn't. Tis a silly thought. I mean, really, who, who would transform some animal into a human to go to some fancy ball? <laughs> Oh, still, I wish I knew who that shoe belonged to, even if she wasn't human. Hmm. Oh, Prince, is that you? It is I, Prince Impeccable, yes. And who are you? Oh, well, I'm nobody. Oh. While you're here, I, can I ask you something? If, oh, yes. <laughs> good. If I asked my mother or father or any of the royal stewards, well, they would just assume I've gone crazy. But you can ask me anything. Oh, good. Okay. It, it might sound silly, but <laughs> do you think that it is possible for a animal to be transformed into a human. Oh, I do. Really, and how would you know that? Well, my fairy godmother transformed a little mouse friend of mine, Butterscotch, into a footman to escort me to the, well. Really, really, okay, now, now, we're, now we're getting somewhere to the ball, right? Yes, to yes, the ball. Yes, wonderful, we're getting somewhere, <laughs> see. I believed that for a, a wee little second there, I was going crazy. Oh, you're not crazy. I was there and we danced all night long. We did, really? Oh, yes, well, does that help at all? Oh, yes, it does, of course. I recognize you, yes. I just, uh, you know, didn't expect to see dirt on your face. Oh, I'm sorry. Well, no, no, it's okay. You're. Very lovely, none the same. You see, the truth is, I've been hoping to find you. I found the shoe you left at my palace and I tried it on every single foot of- Oh, you mean this shoe? Oh, yes, that, that's the one, of course. I have the left one, but now I've found 
the, the right, right one. one. Oh, why should I look upon myself when there are so many others I could look upon instead and fawn over? And that is why you are the fairest of them all, Snow White. You haven't looked in the mirror very much at all in your life. You look for the beauty in others instead. Oh, mirror? No, no, it's true. I've heard it said that beauty is only in the eye of... <laughs> Excuse me. Beauty is, o is only skin deep. True beauty is more beautiful than any mirror's reflection. Oh, mirror, you are more reflective than you realize. I just wish there was a way we could break this curse. No, no, you already have. You see, when the evil queen cast her spell, she cast it because of you. And now that you're overthrowing the evil queen and will be queen yourself, I am no longer under her control. I can be connected to all people and they can be connected through me and my reflections. A real happily ever after, if I say so myself. Oh, here comes Rapunzel now. Oh, hi, Snow. Congrats on the wedding day. Thank you, and belated congrats to you as well. Thank you. Ugh, I'm starting to think it was a bad idea to cut my cut and dye my own hair, but I was confined in that tower for so long, I really didn't have any other option. Got any tips as a girl with short hair? I think you look great, Rapunzel. Just go with it. Good morning, Snow. Are you ready for your big day? As ready as I'll ever be. Oh, what are you going to wear? What shoes? Um, something blue. Oh, wonderful choice. You know, I'm still getting used to wearing these around the palace all day, when my older ones were so much more comfortable. I think you should wear whatever suits you. What is it, Snow? You mustn't weep, it's your wedding day. Oh, well, I just wish we could be together. We do too. Yes, we'll be together very soon. Well, it's time. It won't be lovely, time. Snow. Yes, you do. You look beautiful. And it won't be long before we're all together again. Well, before I go, what's it really like being married to a prince? Is it as happily ever after as they say? Um... <laughs> You'll figure it out. It's a matter Just of perspective. Take it one day at a time and you'll Just you'll figure it out. One another's shoes. Yeah. Well, <laughs> thank you, gals. I'm off. Well, not every day was a fairy tale. But nevertheless, they all lived happily ever after. <laughs> My name is Emma Hall and I'm the stage manager for our show. Uh, I'd like to start by saying thank you so much for coming to see this one of a kind performance. And we've had so much fun putting this together for you all and I hope you enjoyed it as much as we did. Um, this cast of six that you see here, that you saw tonight, put in the time and effort that was meant for a 14 to 29 cast. Um, so I'm very, thankful and proud of them for doing what they did tonight. And I'm
I'm also thankful for our director, Mr. Michael Kleiman, for putting in his time and effort for a show that we otherwise wouldn't have been able to do. Um, and finally, I'd like to thank you guys as a cast, or I mean, as an audience for coming and giving us a reason to continue what we love to do. So thank you everybody for coming to the show and I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you.